I am. Now we are going to November 3rd, current affairs. WHO Southeast Asia Regional Director is Saima Wazi. She is from Bangladesh. Okay. Next. WHO starts from 1948 April. British Academy Book Prize winner 2023 goes to Nandini Dons. The book name is Coating India. World first agreement on AI associated risks signed by how many number of countries? There is 28 number of countries and among them India, India is also one of them. Okay. Next, Exim Bank. Exim Bank means Export and Import Bank. Managing Director of Exim Bank is Harsha Bangari. Who reappointed as Chairman of Armored Forces Tribunal, Justice Rajendra Menon. The second edition of World Food India 2023 is inaugurated by Prime Minister. Who is our Prime Minister? Currently, Narendra Modi. In this second edition, they shows the culture, cuisine, and it's a providing platform for discussions and partnerships and agri-food sectors investments also. Okay. The Election Commission of India has developed one software called Encore. This Encore. What is the oh, what is means by Encore? Enabling communications on real time environment. Okay. Hmm. What is the use of this software? It covers the words, results compilation and data management means how many number of votes are pulled, how many number of votes are valid or non-valid, how many number of people are elected like that place data management is available. Next, the United States military recently conducted a Minuteman 3 missile launch. It is started by, I mean developed by Boeing company. It's a ballistic missile with intercontinental range. Means it, it contains intercontinental range means it has greater range. That means 5,500 kilometers above range. And it can be launched from ground or from submarines also. Okay. It has LGM-30 technology. It is LGM-30 technology. It is prepared by Department of Defense Organizations. Next. Mm. Union Education and Skill Development Entrepreneur Minister, who is Dharmendra Pradhan and he has assigned a memorandum of understanding with UAE Minister of Education. Who is UAE Minister of Education? Dr. Ahmad Ali Al Falasi. Dr. Ahmad Al Falasi. For educational cooperation between two countries. Who was the World Telecommunication Standardization Assembly 2024? That is India. Which country announces visa free entry for Indians and Taiwans to boost tourism? It's a Thailand. From on what day to what day? That is 
टेंथ नवंबर 2023 टू टेंथ मई 2024 फॉर हाउ मेनी डेज इट्स अ 30 डेज यूनियन मिनिस्टर फॉर लेबर एंड एम्प्लॉयमेंट एनवायरनमेंट फॉरेस्ट एंड क्लाइमेट चेंज इज श्री भूपेंद्र यादव ही इनॉग्रेटेड दी 71st फाउंडेशन डे ऑफ दी ईपीएफओ दैट इज employees provident fund organization on what date november 1st at bharat mandapam in new delhi okay what is the theme of the g20 standards dela zero defect and zero effect sorry zero defect zero effect next what is the mou of uh what is the emotion of key aspects we are going to back wait wait ah uh, what is the key aspect of the moon to facilitate the academic collaboration between higher education institutions in both the countries they include the provision of pin pinning means comparison of two courses it provides joint degree where you to where you study two different subjects at the same time next it also provides dual degree programs that is two separate degrees first we take next time to it is both are combination it's a dual degree that memorandum of uh, that memorandum allowing students to benefit from diverse educational experiences okay next kerala government has selected a renewed writer that is t padmanabham padmanabham for prestigious prestigious award of kerala jyoti award on what in Ma, in malayalam malayalam literature next highest india's leading wicket taker wicket taker in world cup history is mohammad sham 45 wickets in 14 matches next who is our rakshak mantri is rajnath singh he inaugurates the india's manufacturing show in bangalore that is 6th edition 